Okay, welcome back to Birth of the Federation. This is session three. Session two didn't record properly, and I just had a slight technical issue. If you're following on that stream, I've quit out and we're restarting again. Apologies for that, but let's see if we can get going here. So, you might notice that we've got several more planets, including some with minor races. Benzar and Soleil were victories of Cardassian diplomacy. We had to bribe the Soleil a little bit to get them on board. The Benzar seemed very keen to join our empire. Norsica and Deneb, well, Deneb were a bunch of sniveling little worms. Norsica, they were talking a big game about how tough they were and everything, but we managed to take them out pretty quickly through military means. We then moved our attention down here. You see, we're now in touch with the Romulans, who seem to broadly be leaving us alone, and the Ferengi. The Ferengi seem to have a problem with the Klingons. They invited us to join a war pact. They'll join. They'll, they'll start a war against the Klingons if we join in. To win this game, under the victory conditions that we have, we're going to have to wipe out the Klingons. So I gambled, and I agreed that this was probably a good idea. We have since become better friends with the Ferengi, even having an economic trade pact with them. We're at a point where we're going to try and take this planet, Peliarzel. Let's give it a whirl. Yes, I think that we can defeat them. Good. Now this should restrict the Klingons' range a little bit. Right, we're going to need to upgrade that. Soleil is empty. Now, I've got a choice here where I could perhaps start building more troop transports. However, I'm concerned that the Klingons may actually have a stronger military than us. Yeah, they do. We need more ships. We haven't really got many good ships to choose from. The cruisers are the most powerful thing that we've got, and they're not massively powerful, but that's the situation we're in. We've taken Peliazel. This is very, very good. We're going to build a shipyard. This will increase Purchase our range. Confirmed. They're going to start starving if I don't do anything, so we'll, we'll chop build some stuff that they need. Romulans rejected, Frankly ignored. Klingons offer a non-aggression pact to us. What we're going to do is we're going to take this. We'll take that money. And then we're going to break it. It's a good look for the Cardassians. They actually are happy if you break treaties, which is kind of bonkers. But we're going to do it. Let's perhaps get ready to take this place down here. Again, maybe a bit of a nothing planet, but this will reduce their range, reduce their territory. I'm working on building strike cruisers. Okay, so I mean, we've got a much better idea of their territory. We can see that quite clearly over here, here, and here. They have five, six, seven planets in total. I wonder if there's anything else that we can do with these guys. Perhaps we can start trying to win the Anticons over with diplomacy. Those Takarans... I'm going to take them down. Hmm. So one of the Klingon planets, one of the Klingon uh, systems is Vulcan. That's interesting. Can't imagine that Klingons and the Vulcans have got an awful lot in common, but... Make some strange bedfellows. Something that's notable is that we are not suffering intelligence-based attacks. Um, 
does make me wonder if we can leverage that a little bit. Let's send a quarter of our power to the Klingons for economic reasons. I want, I want money. I want income from my uh, espionage attempts. So the shipyard was built on Peliazel. That's excellent. Purchase confirmed. They're going to start starving if we don't build some hunting grounds and things like that. This was clearly a very weak planet. Perhaps it had been weakened by the, uh, the Ferengi. I don't know. We have received diplomatic news. We're shocked to hear that we have betrayed the Klingons. <gasps> shocked, I tell you. Shouldn't have been shocked. We're Cardassians, that's what we do. Purchase confirmed. Right, after this, they will have enough food for a little while. We'll start inquisiting. What's the state of our... State of our, uh, um... Everyone seems pretty pleased, content, apathetic, disgruntled. Okay, sure. It was generally kind of happy. Uh, looks like we've got a fleet there. I might just actually hold back here. Consolidate these fleets. Yes, it's only one additional ship, but makes a difference to me. Okay, do we have, uh, let's get our research evened out a little bit more. Yeah, that's more or less. We've got a big boost for construction, that's great. That's the, uh, the Benzites who provide that for us. Um... What were we doing as well? We were kind of we're trying to get these guys on board. Let's see if this improves at all. They're just they're just dead stuck into the neutral kind of uh, state of mind. Received diplomatic news. Who's built in Soleil? Let's let's see about building some strike cruisers. I want some of these. So they take three turns at the moment. Can we bump that up a little bit? No. If that's not going to do anything, then we may as well put that into research. Gain a little bit of something out of that. What do we got here? Battle cruiser, battle cruiser. I mean, let's go here. Okay, got the terraforming coming along nicely. Select a planet to terraform. <sighs> Going to be looking to go for MNR. They actually have some uh, orbital batteries online. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six major ships. Um, Maybe what I'll do here, it's a bit easier to keep an eye on this. Six, and we've got six destroyers and two scouts as well. 
this task force this could be a bit of a bit of a messy fight it really could I want to take them on though yeah, we can take the transports. I don't think they're going to be targeting the transports. Okay, we don't have any idle planets. Let's see what happens. Oh, Our they buggered off. Defeated the enemy. Control declare war against the Romulans. I wouldn't. Norsica has enough trade for a new trade route. That's actually valid because we can trade with the uh, the Ferengi. Um, I'd love to start churning out some troop transports here, but I just. You know, I, I, I kind of can't, really. Okay, here we go. Vulcan ships, six battle cruisers. Well, that would even things up a little bit, wouldn't it, if they decide to flip and well have a go at us? Planetary assault confirmed. Planetary assault confirmed. We're not going to um, try and take the planet, not until we've got rid of those defenses. Entkins, receptive, huh? Receptive. Did you actually accept... Are we friends with them? Friendship, huh? What do you know? Anybody else up for trading? So, as we trade with them... That will grow our uh, relationship with them. You know, eventually we'll be able to have a very good chance of inducting them into our wonderful empire. Okay, here we go, here we go. You guys yes, get the flipping heck out of here. Um, what have they got? 140, 340. About even keel. Um, what are they doing? They're flying by, are they? Understood. We have them. Yes, sir. They're circling, are they? We don't have an awful lot of. Um, don't have an awful lot of tactics open to us. Strafe. And what were they doing again? They are circling. Yes, sir. I expect a swift kill. Okay, let's just hold our breath and see how this goes. Okay, we've suffered some losses, they've suffered some losses. I'll tell you what I will do. Acknowledged. I expect a swift This kick. apparently I is expect a swift Acknowledged. I expect a good strategy. A kill. Yes, sir. I expect I think I want to double up here. Kick. We I expect a swift Yes, sir. I expect a swift Kill. Acknowledged. We have them. Where shall we strike? So they're assaulting, are they? Aye, sir. We have them. Where shall we have them? We're gonna try Where and just we... We have reduce them. their numbers. Acknowledged. We have them. Yeah, come on, man. Finish that, go on, that guy off. Okay.
Understood. We have them. Evasive action. Keep us moving. Understood. We well, we outnumber them. Where shall we have them? Where shall we have them? One of theirs is extremely badly damaged. We should be able to take it out. Or not. Where I don't know what they're doing, unfortunately. Where shall we strike? We I think we should them. strike. Aye, sir. We have them. Where shall we Let's team up there. You mate, you sir. keep on evading. They really look like they're just charging, don't they? Understood. Acknowledged. Yes, sir. We have them. Yeah, you keep evading, mate. Okay, success. Victory. Something of a Pyrrhic victory. Um, we lost a lot of ships there. What we've got left is damaged. Lost a ship in the uh, bombardment there as well. Okay, the strike cruisers are being pumped out. That's very good. We are going to need... Uh... Yeah, we are going to need an outpost. We could just keep wiping this place out, but I think, I think a retreat is in order. Yeah, we are... We're down. We, uh, we've lost a lot of ships there. We can't easily replace ships because we only have one source of the lithium. To um, so that's not good. What have we got left? Just a couple of cruisers. We're going to have four cruisers left. Oh, damn it. You know what? You know what? As a wise man once said, fortune favors the bold. Let's finish the job. If we can take this place out, we can build a shipyard on there. What I might do, what I might do because we do actually have some people not engaged in production there. Sure, a little slower, but we can use this as our production planet just for a bit while we get Soleil built up. Alright, orbital batteries won. That's bad. Three command against one fast attack. Well... Hmm... Shall we strike? We have them. You look pretty badly damaged. No, you're kind of okay. Yeah, I figured that they would go for the retreat. Resistance. I mean, I, I don't know what the state of their fleet is, but I think that we've we've crippled it essentially. For any sign of non-aggression, for any sign of non-aggression with the Romulans, they're pretty friendly. Okay, have we finished our inquisitorial work here? Kind of looks like it, doesn't it? Okay, we'll come back to that in a bit. The Neb. I don't actually want that to be powered. I'm 
kind of finding stuff to build just so that I can I can come back to them later. It'll it'll spur me on, it'll remind me to come back to them later. Planetary assault confirmed. Okay, how are we doing with the old Antkins? They're pretty receptive. I wonder if they want to be a little bit closer. Frangie! They're going great guns. You know what? It'd be real nice if you want to do some of this. You guys, Sodja. I mean, let's see if we can be a little bit more friendly with the Romulans. You guys, we're going to take you out at some point. Just telling you. Just letting you know. No attacking ships destroyed, orbital battery destroyed. And let's face it, they don't look like a particularly powerful planet, do they? So, uh, yes, do that, please. I think, or well, we can probably planetary assault do this. Confirmed. Um, yep, yeah, that's better. So nothing's actually happened. We haven't. We don't seem to have made any progress with our intelligence actions against the Klingons yet. It's fine. Let's save this. Selection confirmed. Saving the game. Let's just have a quick look. Military. They're still considered militarily superior to us. We've caught up in science, economy. We're pretty happy. We have received diplomatic news. There is news from intelligence. <sighs> okay. All right. I didn't think that they would be able to do uh, resist us. They clearly can. Uh, Rejected, rejected, rejected. External affairs suffered a failure. Temporary loss of effectiveness. Well, let's knock it off then. Right now. very frustrating. I needed... Yeah, I needed to take this. Let's not leave him stranded there. Let's... Actually, yeah, no, let's keep on just taking this place out. We could... Planetary assault we could confirmed. simply bombard it out of existence. Terraforming completed. Layers empty. Oh, hang on a minute. This was to be our mass production planet, wasn't it? We're simply using Benzar at the moment because... Okay, so we can't build these any faster than three turns. Yes, I know there's a lithium shortage. All 
All right, look, we're going to come back here once we finish building a ship on Benza. Oh, Benza's finished. Good. Okay, we don't need you to keep doing that. Thank you very much. Let's get a strike cruiser over there. Ooh, we could do with a we could do with a flipping outpost here to make that a little bit easier. Right, if we were to build Okay. First First build that. A couple more strike cruisers, that's fine. Might build a, a, an outpost there, I'm just thinking about that. <sighs> Frangia Frang really... Pretty friendly. Antikin's receptive. To Karens, I kind of want to take them out. 13 orbital batteries, that's... That's a fair amount of orbital batteries, unfortunately. Does it gain us experience for our ships? It doesn't seem to. Right, let's build... An outpost here. No, build it here. Should get rid of that. Create a bit of a shortcut, basically. And I think actually. We're going to want another one. We have received diplomatic news. Antkins rejected, rejected. We're being rejected everywhere. Okay, that's fine. I mean, if we can build and maintain an outpost there, that would be splendid. Cool, they got a lot of ships there. That looks like the uh, uh, Ferengi fleet. Let's just check that everybody who's got an economic route is trading. Yes, they are. MNR taken by the Ferengi. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, that gives us something less to deal with, quite frankly. Something less to worry about. Oh, no, actually, you're going there, aren't you? Or thereabouts. Select a planet to terraform. Still not that productive, are you, Cardassia? A Phoenix facility, plus 100 intelligence. It's got to be a native system. Uh, energy is 30. We're going to have to bump that up a little bit.
We're looking to push deeper into Klingon territory right here. Outpost construction confirmed. Like to know what those planets are there. Could be their home planets. Outpost construction confirmed. The Obsidian Order. We can build the Obsidian Order. Now that's pretty nice, right? Yes, this is worth it. Phoenix facility, plus 100 intelligence, it's, it's definitely worth it, I would say. Let's build that and then just just work on that. That's fine. Where are we as far as tech? What what are we staring down the barrel of? What are we potentially going to be able to build? Battleships? No. Battleships look like the big scaries, really. No, heavy cruisers look even heavier. We're still a ways away from, from being able to build those. That's... That's okay, that's what it is. One more planet to do here. Select a planet to terraform. It's all about the Anticons, baby. I mean, that's that's not too big an expense as far as uh, bribing goes. Saving game. We can bribe them every couple of turns, and we're not really we losing anything. Diplomatic news. Turn of security has discovered a Klingon spy. That is absolutely fantastic. The Romulans offer an affiliation proposal. Sure thing, baby. Treaty. I've been looking to make friends with them. That's it's good. That's really good. Let's have a look here. We might well have to retreat immediately as soon as uh, we see what's there. It's, it's probably something that's not, it's probably something quite scary. The Federation declare war against the Romulans. Frankie, you declare war against the Romulans. We've signed an affiliation treaty with the Romulans. It's a, it's a big day for, uh, for diplomacy, I would say. All right, all right. Yeah, they got they got quite fleet. They got quite fleet. Uh, there is an outpost there. This is a bit of a nothing planet. It's good to know that that's there. Ugh, how long are you going to take building this bloody outpost? All right. At least we can get our fleet together now, such as it is. Terraforming completed. We have received diplomatic news. Antikins rejected. Frangi issue a demand. Romulans issue a demand. Okay. I think we should have ba a couple of basic can fight ships, shouldn't we? Let's let's see if we can build them any quicker. Three turns. What if we pump a bit more into production? Yes. Make 
four of those. Colonization in progress. It's crazy that we've just formed some very positive, uh, y y you know, relationships with these guys, and now they're making demands. Uh, I mean, actually, kind of could. I could just ignore them, but this will be accepted. This goes down a little bit better if you actually do acquiesce to them. Um, it's fine. We will we'll get them back somewhere further down the line. They're going to regret that. You're being all defiant, are you? Welcome to the Inquisition. Get ready for some. Uh, re-education as well. Nine warships, six warships. We can't defeat them at all. I mean, if they... If they come into our space, then they're just... They can have it, basically. We can't do anything against a fleet that size, unfortunately. Yet. Our ambitions to build an outpost will be... gone. Just in case this doesn't work, I'm gonna I'm gonna build a load of troop transports. We can build um, outposts with those. We claim this system in the <sighs> that was a very quick war. Confirmed. Okay, I don't know where that scary ass looking fleet is. No, don't go there. Go there. This outpost is taking a very, very long time to build. Uh, let's have a quick look at all of the planets. Disgruntled, fine, yeah, sure. Nah, I'm not rushing that. How are we for finances? We took a big old hit acquiescing to those demands, but... Go on, you have a bit of cash as well. Unpowered, huh? Actually, that makes a lot more sense to take it from here, since it's an intelligence structure. Simply replacing that with something way more effective. The Obsidian Order, and it's got to be on the home system. Bit of a big ask. Um... We'll come back to that and we'll rush build that in a bit. That's that's a good... It looks like a very good thing to have, definitely. This is our newly settled planet. Purchase confirmed. No, not a fusion plant. Why? Sure, we've got to build fusion plants at some point. I'm meaning to build uh, production facilities. 
Okay, that's one ship. I think we could probably deal with one ship. If we can find that planet, and if it is unprotected, we'd be able to take that. Purchase confirmed. Take that with what we got. this we've we've got a lot of friends out here it's good selection confirmed saving game Frankie signed a non-aggression treaty yeah my gosh they really do bounce between treaties and things don't they it's it's, it's kind of bonkers Plus 50 energy, 30 energy. Purchase confirmed. We just get some of the basics up here and then we will, uh, and then we'll put it on auto just so we don't have to micromanage it. Oh, how many turns has this taken? How far away we are from getting star bases? Hmm, not far. Um, four, 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 four. Yep. Outpost. The Karens are probably a little bit annoyed at us building stuff right next to them. Um, I don't care though. Aliazel, that's a bit of a nothing planet. I'm going to keep an eye on it, just uh, I certainly don't want them to rebel or anything like that. Purchase. Yeah, these are all fairly cheap, these things. I mean, it's not... Build an assembly yard again next, and then we'll just make it so that we can be sure that they won't starve. The Hendikens rejected. You guys. Uh, yeah, actually. Confirmed. What do we got here? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six meaningful ships, plus spare change of four meaningful ships plus that's it Again, we're mostly just going for wiping out planets. That's what we want to do. So strike cruisers are kind of the order of the day. They're very easy to use as well. I mean, there's, there's sort of one strategy with them, basically. Take a look at the summary, just see that everybody's doing stuff. Yeah, you're disgruntled, I don't care. You're disgruntled, I don't care. Ooh, you're pleased. Content, pleased. 
We've got some got some happy peeps out there. I gotta say, the uh, Ferengi are on a diplomatic blitz. Aren't they just, huh? Plus 40 ground combat. I mean, that's... I think we could actually do with a little bit of that. Start building that. Ooh, 300 power. Jeez. Yeah, we're going to need more of those. Boreal. Purchase confirmed. We'll come back to it in a bit. Okay, looks like, kind of looks like the, that Klingon fleet is going somewhere. Will they suddenly swing by and attack us? They might. Okay, they look like they split as well. For an affiliation proposal, yepers will be accepted. Was this the thing? Yeah, this is the thing Purchase that can confirmed. give us a huge boost to our ground combat. Let's just save. It looks like we're uh, engaging in a, a bit Selection of a new era here. Confirmed. We are game. preparing to go deeper into Klingon territory and start taking some stuff. Ooh. Well, they have a very big fleet there, don't they? Very big fleet. Four, five, six, seven, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen actually capable ships. We have eight. I know it's not strictly a numbers game, but I don't like those numbers. I do. I really, really hope they surrender because we don't have much of a chance. We're going to send in the troop transports to try and get the best of them first. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we'll do our best. Aye, 
sir. We have them. Weapons ready. Confirmed. No price. Resistance. The price of resistance. Mm, it's going better than I thought it might, actually, to be fair. Where shall we st We have them. Understood. We have them. Where we have them. Where shall we st We have them. Understood. We'll do our best. Not even kidding. I think we did better than I would have expected. Um, what do we get? We got one ship, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I mean, got a handful of them. But on that depressing note, I think that we will call it a stream there. Um, I still like where we are. I still like the look of things. We could build a fleet to defeat them. We're going to call that a stream there. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully catch you on the next one. Ooh, look. That's Kronos. That is their home planet. Hmm.